हेलो होप ऑल आर फाइन एंड सेफ दिस इज कोकिला भाटिया सुपरवाइजर ऑफ स्टेट विद्या मंदिर वसई ईस्ट टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट पैरल लाइन्स एंड अ ट्रांसवर्सल दिस इज द सेकेंड लेसन ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड एट्थ मैथमेटिक्स ऑफ महाराष्ट्र बोर्ड वॉट आर पैरल लाइन्स दीज आर द टू पैरल लाइन्स लाइन एल is parallel to line m so we can say that two lines or more lines which are in the same plane but do not intersect each other are called parallel lines so here line l is parallel to line m it can be represented by the sign line l parallel line m distance between the parallel lines are always constant it means that all points of one line and other line is constant that is equal now what is transversal line n is a transversal for line l and line m transversal is a line which intersects two or more lines at different points and this is called transversal angles made by transversal and by two or more lines there are four types of angles formed by two lines and a transversal they are corresponding angles interior angles alternate an interior angles and alternate exterior angles corresponding angles the ang angles which are on the alleged sides and above side of the line that is only on one side is called corresponding angles angle p and angle w is a pair of corresponding angles angle q and angle x is a pair of corresponding angles now angles made below the two lines and on the edges of the transversal is also called corresponding angles angle s and angle z is a pair of corresponding angles angle r and angle y is a pair of corresponding angles now we can say that when there is one transversal and two lines there are total four pairs of corresponding angles that are created the four pairs formed are angle p and angle w angle s and angle z angle q and angle x angle r and angle y interior angles a pair of angles which are on the same side of the transversal and inside the given lines are called interior angles two pairs of interior angles are created that is angle s and angle w angle r and angle x alternate interior angles it means opposite sides of the transversal on the above side and below side but inside the two lines the two pairs of alternate interior angles are created that is angle s and angle x angle r and angle w alternate exterior angles it means above and below out of the alternate interior angles is called alternate exterior angles the two pairs of alternate exterior angles are created that is angle p and angle y angle q and angle z now we know that 
with one transfer cell and two lines four types of angles are formed and with it we should remember that we can form four pairs of corresponding angles two pairs of interior angles two pairs of alternate interior angles and two pairs of alternate exterior angles thank you god bless